track 9. Listen and fill in the blanks. I'm a student in grade 6 at Sunflower International School. I like going to school every day to have useful lessons and enjoy time with my friends. A special thing about my school is the canteen. It serves a variety of delicious foods. They always prepare healthy foods on a tray. We usually have rice, meat, soup, vegetables, and a drink for lunch. Once a week, they cook traditional Vietnamese dishes like pho, bun bò, ban can, or serve fast foods like hamburgers, sandwiches, fried chicken, and chips with soft drinks. We also have fresh fruits such as cherries, apples, watermelons and strawberries. Every student loves having lunch at the canteen. Track 10. Listen and circle the correct answer. What is Anna's favorite food? I am hungry. I want to eat some food. Would you like to eat beef steak? No, thanks. I'm allergic to beef. What would you like to eat? I love to have some fried chicken, which is my favorite. 2. Where is Lucy? Lucy, can you help me buy some vegetables? I'm in the cinema now, but when do you need them? Don't worry, I need them for tomorrow. That's fine, I'll stop by the supermarket and buy for you. 3. What is mom cooking? Is mom cooking some spaghetti? I don't think so, she brought some pork to make a barbecue. Great, I love grilled pork. Me too. 4. Where is Jane going to eat? Hi Jane, it's lunchtime. I'm starving. Are there any good places nearby? Do you want to eat at the Italian restaurant across the street? No, I just tried some pasta yesterday. How about the Japanese restaurant on the corner? Oh, I can't eat raw fish. Let's eat pho at Saigon restaurant. It's new, but it's worth trying. It sounds like a good idea. Track 11. Listen and choose the correct answer. In this section of the test, you will hear students talking about food. Each talk is followed by one question. Choose the best answer to each question. You will hear the talk only one time. Here is an example. Listen to a student talking about the Tet holiday. Tet is the most important holiday for Vietnamese people. During Tet, my family makes our traditional dishes to put on the altar of our ancestors. My grandparents make square sticky rice cakes with rice, mung beans, and pork. The cake symbolizes the ground expressing our gratitude to the earth. My parents make Vietnamese braised pork with eggs. We always eat this dish with pickled vegetables. Finally, my sister makes candied fruits. These dishes help us remember the culture and traditions of the Tet holidays. What dishes do his grandparents make during Tet? The correct answer is B. Square sticky rice cakes. 1. Listen to a student talking about her favorite food. My favorite food is chocolate cakes. On my 12th birthday, my grandma made it for me. It was so amazing. I still love chocolate cakes even now. 
Last weekend, my grandma taught me how to bake it. It was not easy to make. My cake was ugly, but it tasted sweet and delicious. What's her favorite food? Two. Listen to a student talking about his traditional meal. Last week, my mom made our family's traditional meal, bun cha. The dish had grilled pork with white rice noodles and dipping sauce, bun cha, originated in Hanoi. My mom's dish was delicious. Everyone in my family had a big bowl of it. Where did bun cha come from? Three. Listen to a student talking about her dish. Yesterday was my father's birthday. I cooked a special dish for him as a present. I made spring rolls. I put ground pork, shrimps, carrots, mushrooms, and some spices in the bowl. Then I mixed them and wrapped them with rice paper to make spring rolls. Finally, my mom and I fried the rolls. My dad loved the dish and gave me a big hug. What ingredients are in her spring rolls? Four. Listen to a student talking about his favorite meal. My favorite meal is dinner. At dinner, I can have food with my whole family. We eat and share our stories. Sometimes my mom makes special dishes that are delicious and different. Last night she made sticky rice with mushrooms. That was her first time making sticky rice. It was weird, but everyone was happy with the new dish. What was his mother's new dish? Five. Listen to a student talking about how to make scrambled eggs. Last week, my dad made his signature dish: scrambled eggs. First, he cracked four eggs into a clean bowl. Then he added milk, salt, and pepper. My dad beat the mixture with a fork, and he poured it into a hot pan. He fried the eggs gently to make a beautiful scrambled eggs dish. How many eggs did her dad put in the scrambled eggs? Six. Listen to a student talking about her shopping at the food market. Last Saturday, my mom asked me to buy some ingredients for the fish hot pots. I went to the food market near my house to buy ingredients for it. On my mom's list, I had to buy a pineapple and one bunch of salad. I went to the vegetable stall, but they were all out of pineapples. So I bought five tomatoes for the hot pot. They're both sour anyway. Then I bought two bunches of salad. I love vegetables, so I brought more of them. When I went back home, my mom said that we had too many vegetables. What vegetables did the girl not buy because the stall was out of it?